Hello there, how's it going on lads? So today what we are going to learn is how we can build an application which is for supporting the voice. So we have an input as a string or in the form of text. So we need to convert that uh, text in the form of uh, speech or as a kind of voice. So in this uh, video I have given the languages which is supported by the voiceover. Which is, this is the latest one. I will provide this URL in my video description. So these languages are latest which is supported by the voiceover so these are available now all right so let's start doing it so these are the language codes so which I have uh, so these are the codes and there may be some missing language codes uh, that you need to find out there all right so I'll be providing this as well in my video description and also the source code so let's start doing it so I'm going to create a new project from here so this is going to be a project uh, it's going to be an iOS and single view application I'm going to name it as uh, speech app and uh, the language uh, it's going to be storyboard and the language will be shift and storage nothing else uh, identify just going to be called dot blue going to save it in my uh, iOS project folder all right cancel this then I'm going to my main dot storyboard let's make a button quickly for that uh, action we're going to initialize the speech all right so let's search for a button I'm going to drag it over here let me put it in the middle of the screen all right and then I'm going to put some constraints let's say it speak now Okay, let's go some uh, out outlet for this and I'm going to give an action. Let's say speak now tapped. space over here all right so first thing is I'm going to import here AV kit then I'm going to initialize war uh, synthesizer that is going to be an AV speed synthesizer And then I'm going to put this action in the action I'm going to go let utterance equal to uh, a v speech utterance which is a kind of a string so gonna be a string so let's put a string we'll put the string later let's complete this so utterance dot uh, Right, it's nothing but the uh, speed of thing, so let be 50 or whatever, and then the other end start volume. So, this can be a uh, zero, which means uh, there will be no voice, it can be one or something else. I put this one, let it be, and then uh, at range start uh, voice. That's the main part, which is going to synthesize this text or a speech voice and this is where we're going to go put the language and the code over there and then 
finally I'm going to synthesizer dot speak utterance which is going to be this utterance all right simple and from there uh, let me try first with English so let me check for the language which is for English let's say this coming back to the Xcode and the text which I need to confirm is uh, let me say hello there what do you have for dinner tonight all right that will be this let me run this in a simulator and check whether this works or not because uh, it was working before and now uh, maybe in the latest iOS version it's supposed to be uh, supporting in the phone because there is a voice assistant feature now nowadays so we need to enable that so I don't know I'm not sure whether it worked in the simulator let's try that if not uh, we will run in a real device and check all right All right, so let's make this big and let's click on speak now button. Oh, there is something going on, right? I don't know what's that. Cylinder identifier. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to the setting and going to search for the accessibilities. So. Here we can find this in the settings. There's this called uh, accessibility, and from there, uh, there's something called uh, speech content, and also voices. From here, you can find the, the list of language list and uh, watch. Uh, let me check those for English. So I have given the country code as uh, US. So I'm going to click this and let test Isn't this. Isn't it nice to have a computer that will talk to you? okay I have selected this so if in case you're going to select for uh, English for India you can just go here it will be like this you need to download that gone for selection you can test hello, it the voice my as well name is Isha. hello my name all right then let me try to run this again Alright, so let me click the speak now. This didn't work as well. I don't know what's the reason. So let me try in my real device. Alright. So I have connected my real device and let me try with my phone. Run this. Okay, let me run this. Check. Hello there. What do you have for dinner tonight? One more time. Hello there. What do you have for dinner tonight? All right, that's all. So, if in case if the voice if you seem that after doing the code it doesn't work means you just go to the settings and go for this accessibility or uh, in the settings so you can find here accessibility and inside this you can find here the spoken content and there you can find the voices here there are some options which you can select that uh, speak screen speak selection all these things you don't need to worry about that so just go here list of languages there so based on your requirement for example uh, if you want to go for Arabic just go here Arabic and click any of the things like this and just if it, in case it is not downloaded just download it and make it enabled by clicking there is a tick mark over there that's it simple and then when you change the country code and try to convert that you'll be easy to form 
so one thing you need to make sure is um, if you're converting some other languages other than English so put the exact string according to their country for example if you're Arabic so go and put the string as Arabic so that it will, it will be speaking if you're in German go for a German string or text in here over here replace this with a German text and then the code as well S and try this as per the accessibility and the real device I recommend that for because for simulator it didn't work for me and try this maybe that will the only solution all right then so that's all in this video uh, i hope this video may help someone else uh, this is the latest version of this um, text to speech or a text to voice in 2023 all right then have a nice day see you in the next video bye